is sideways. This is the main event from St. Louis, Missouri. The 250 class is off. Ricky Carmichael on the inside gets pushed to the inside. He will not pick up a whole shot, and we have a new rider out in front, and that is an amazing ride for Danny Smith. Danny Smith, but Chad Reed came down along the inside. Smith got the whole shot, and now Carmichael's second. This is what we've been waiting for, a nighttime Supercross. Reed and Carmichael starting one and two. This is what we've been waiting for. Oh, let the microwave dinner burn, folks. We've been waiting all year for this. Chad Reed in front, Ricky Carmichael in second. The battle is on. Chad Reed continues to lead. I think he had so much pressure on him coming out of the 125 East last year. Everyone said, Chad Reed and Ricky, Chad Reed and Ricky. And a lot of people didn't give Ricky credit. He is the two-time defending champion. And for reasons like that, Carmichael just triples out. So long, Chad Reed. He overtakes him. And Reed now making a run on the whoop section. I'm not sure what happened there, Todd. I think he came out of the corner and missed a gear or something because he's not going that fast. So now this is where Ricky's had problems all night through the whoops. Reed come up on the inside and Reed makes the pass holy smokes squares it off Ricky knew he had the position so he just backed off just a little bit Carmichael now planning his next spot and folks I'll tell you what we have been waiting all year for this battle to materialize and it looks like tonight we've got it and now Ricky goes by on the inside passes Reed in the same spot that he passed him earlier and that time Chad didn't really mess up so Carmichael repays the favor and now we're back to the whoops that time Ricky gets through quick. Well, he set himself up perfectly. I think Ricky knew he wanted to have that inside line. Just setting a fierce pace. They have completely pulled away from the rest of the field. And now comes Reed on the inside, swings to the outside. And you saw Ricky kind of stunt or just fade just a little bit there. And there goes Reed again. So we've had four passes so far, folks, and we are only halfway through this. Oh my goodness, Chad Reed out in front. Ricky Carmichael, the two-time defending champion and points leader in second. He cannot shake him. Carmichael, though, showing some patience right here, looking for a new line. The last time Carmichael did that a little differently, doubled through, and that time he got back up on top of him. Oh! Oh, Carmichael comes up way short on that. And he's kept that bike running somehow. Carmichael kept that bike running. Todd, he got out there on the tough blocks. He probably got cross -rutted. We will have to take another look at that. Unbelievable. Look at his, look at Ricky Carmichael's left leg when he comes over this jump. Yeah, he just got cross right there. You see him try to save it. Stayed on the gas, but look at that. He had the fortitude to hold that clutch in. He kept the bike running, kind of minimalized the damage. Now, will we see a kind of race like we saw at Pontiac last year, where Carmichael comes back up through? Believe it or not, he's only back in fifth place. But Ricky Carmichael is now trying to get around Ernesto Fonseca, who's really impeding his progress. He's a teammate, finally gets a random, so Carmichael back into third, Smith in second. I would not be surprised if Carmichael picks up Smith on this next lap, but he is 10 seconds behind Chad Reed, and that is almost an eternity with the Australian out in front. But Chad Reed is so far out in front, I think Ricky's starting to panic just a little bit, knowing that he's got about a half a race to try to track him down. Ricky Carmichael's last lap time, 53-4, Reed a 53-5. And right there, Todd, he took the high line over Smith. Now he's got a clear track. Now we'll see if he can cut into that lead of Chad Reed. Well, Ricky has closed down just a little bit, but I think that's because Chad has taken the time to celebrate on his way in. And your winner in the 250 main from St. Louis, the Thunder from down under, Chad Reed on board the Yamaha. He picks up the victory. Carmichael comes through.